In this video, we're going to discuss how you memorize a bill. Why would you want to do this? When you have a bill that's reoccurring monthly, instead of having to remember to enter it in every month, so rent, for example, the first of the month sneaks up on us a lot of times. So if you want QuickBooks to automatically enter that rent payment every month so that you're set up and you don't have to think about it, uh, you want to memorize a bill. So I'm going to go ahead in here and I'm going to select who my vendor is. We're going to say vendor is the great statewide bank. That's who our rent payment goes to. Reference number, you can put a reference number in here if you want to. Amount due, $500. Which account is it going to? It's going to rent, not rent and occupancy, I'm sorry. Going to rent. Make sure and choose that proper sub. What class it needs to go to, overhead. All right, and if I want to put any memos in there. So here's what you do. You go up under edit and you say memorize bill. And it's going to pop up for you here. What transaction, what do you want to name this? So monthly rent. Do I want it to be added as a reminder to enter the bill monthly? Do I not want to be reminded about this at all and only go in and have to force it in? Or do I want it to automatically enter monthly? So I'm going to say automate this transaction entry. How often? Monthly. The next date it needs to be entered in is 1231. How many are remaining? If you have a term you know, of two years, so you can say 24 remaining. How many days in advance do you want to enter the bill in? So if it's due the 31st of every month or the last day of every month, I want the bill to be entered in probably about 15 days ahead of time so that it tells me 15 days ahead of time that this bill is due on the 31st. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and say okay in there. So at this point, I can save this bill or what I probably want to do is I want to clear it out of here because I don't want to save that bill. I want to let it automatically enter my bill for me. Okay, so to get this generated, because the, the dates are a little funny here and we're going to do it live. So I'm, excuse me, I went to the wrong list there. Memorize transaction list here. Okay, so you see your monthly rent. Tells you some information right there. It's monthly, it's on auto to auto enter it in. And the next date is 1231. So let's just pretend it's 1231. I'm going to force it in today. Okay, I come in here. I enter the reference number if I want to. Say save and close. Now note that it says the next date is 131. So it knows that next month, 10 days before 131 or 15 days before 131, it's going to automatically enter that bill in for you. And that's how you memorize a bill.